Go. Hey guys, welcome back to Downtown Crown Wine and Beers Feature of the Week. Uh, we have the pleasure to be here in Baltimore at Union Brewery and sitting here with co-founder of Union Brewery, Adam Vinesh. Uh, we have a tap takeover Friday, January 22nd from 5 p.m. to 8 p.m. We're going to have eight beers on the tap. Um, the list is great. Dave? Yeah, we got an awesome list. We have uh, eight beers. We have some classics. We have Duck Pin. We have Anthem. We have Ann Gold. Uh, we have Snow Pants. And then we have four beers that are brand new being released. Bolo, a session sour. We have Sour Wonder, which is a, a red sour, or a, a brown sour. Yep, yep. Um, and uh, Rye Baby, which is their winter seasonal IPA. And then we have an awesome six to limited barrel aged Chessy. It's uh, uh, their barrel aged barley wine. With Elijah Wood. Elijah yeah. yep. Elijah Craig, Elijah. 12 year barrel aged. Yeah. So, Adam. Um, Tell us a little bit of history about Union. Like, what year did you guys start? Like, how'd you get into it? Or? Yeah, no, uh, we, uh, we've been brewing here in Baltimore about three and a half years, coming up on four years this summer. Uh, myself uh, and two good friends, John and Kevin, uh, all born in the Baltimore area, uh, grew up around here, and combined our passions of, of love for craft beer and our home city of Baltimore to create this brewery uh, coming up in four years now. Cool. Uh, for our customers that, you know, come in a lot, you've probably seen this stacked all the time. Um, it's their double IPA. It's fantastic. You guys are re you guys are gonna brew more in March. Brewing it today, actually. Uh, brewing it today. Sweet. It'll be ready, kind of the last week of February. Nice. Yeah. Um, it's a good day to come, right? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> also, one thing to note: uh, it's predicted big snow um, on Friday. Don't let that hinder you from coming out. Um, snow pants, their oatmeal style will be on tap. Anybody that shows up uh, wearing snow pants on Friday, their first pint of uh, snow, snow pants. pants will be a dollar. We're not gonna advertise it on email or Facebook or anything. Only through this video. So. If you watch this video and you wear snow pants, you get one of these pints for a dollar. I mean, you can't beat that deal. Nice. Yeah. Uh, now, Adam, like I want to talk to you about, you guys just recently made the move into Virginia, um, and you guys, you know, we had an event with you at Dominion Wine and Beer, which was yeah. fantastic. Like, you know, like all the beer guys were waiting for a double duck pan. They filled their growlers of it. What are your plans for Montgomery County? And like, well, what are your overall plans in 2016? How do you keep it's these? Keep the ball rolling. Yeah, keep yeah. the ball rolling because you guys have been hot for a while now. Like, how do you just keep it, keep that moving? Yeah, I mean, I think for 2016, so we we entered the Northern Virginia market. And just really, there's two counties in Northern Virginia at the end of 2015. Uh, and I think we'll probably stick with that territory for most of 2016. I think there's a lot more to do in the Maryland, D.C., Northern Virginia market. How about MoCo specifically? And, like, then, and obviously in places like MoCo where we haven't been able to put as much focus as we wanted to there because we wouldn't have, haven't had enough beer to do it. Well, we've, we've, we've got focus. Exactly. <laughs> you, know, well, you know, downtown ground yeah. knows how to do it. Um, but we want to be able to uh, get you more of our uh, more limited releases and get more of our core beers down in all over Montgomery County. When's, uh, when's Old Pro coming back out? Old Pro, we're excited for Old Pro season to come upon us we'll be uh we'll have that out on can by mid early to mid april i know you guys are excited yeah right? yeah well so similar something about. similar to opro right now is your bolo yep. Um, yep you guys want to taste that yeah okay. so what is it so this, this is a cool new beer we just uh kegged it about a week ago a brand new beer for us um it's the first beer in a, a collaboration series that we're putting together one of the things we're more excited about in 2016 um, we're doing a series uh, partnering up with breweries uh, that got their start in Maryland, somewhere in Maryland, uh, uh, and learned how to brew here in Maryland that have now moved elsewhere around the country and opened a brewery and uh, are making beers somewhere else. Uh, and so this first one, we partnered up with our good friends from Austin Beer Works in, Te in Austin, Texas. Uh, two of the founders there uh, from Frederick, Maryland, uh, got their early brewing roots out of Frederick Brewing Company. And so uh, Will Golden, our good friend, uh, was in town during the holidays. We brewed this session sour, sour ale with him. Uh, Bolo, which we're excited to have out on the market right now. Uh, does Bolo yeah. mean anything? Like So Bolo, um, it can mean a few things, but what Bolo really is, is it's those Texas ties. It's that little metal thing with the little strings hanging down. Oh, the Texas ties of the Bolo. Gotcha. So we named it after that. So you guys um, will distribute this out like in Austin, around that area? Of well, as well no, so obviously it's, it, you know, we can't send it to Texas because we don't distribute it there. So right. this beer will be available, available just in Maryland and D.C. Oh, cool. And then we hope to get the Austin later this year and brew it there as well uh, so they can send it around to uh, Texas. Cool. So what's ABV on this? So ABV is 4.4%. There's a really drinkable sour beer. We, we use lactobacillus in this, which gives it that sour tartness. It's the same bacteria that goes into Greek yogurt. And so you get that similar kind of, not super sour, but nice tartness to it. Yeah, I mean, citric tartness. These sours are super drinkable and like give much more approachable than some of the sours that we have at our store that are bottled. Like, you know, they're just like, it's not cool. wild. It's right. Really cleaner. It's really good. Um, so the next beer, and this is the beer that, you know, we have the special one if you actually wear snow pants. Yeah. Uh, hey, snow pants oatmeal video. stout. Yep. So what's this? Snow pants is our winter seasonal. It's an 8% oatmeal stout. Really rich, creamy body. 
uh, big chocolate roast malts in there uh, oh. that give it a lot of that flavor. 8%? Really, eight oh, percent. Yeah, man. super drinkable eight percent. Uh, sometimes it's gotten me in trouble, but I, you know. that looks good. With yeah. That, that mouthfeel. Yeah, yeah, yeah that nice creamy uh, mouthfeel uh, really gives it that nice body. Um, really fun winter beer, perfect for drinking uh, in the cold weather in and around uh, town. Sweet. Cool. Well, you know, you guys have been like I said, you guys have like started off hot and you guys have kept hot with like these cool cans and you know really riding this wave and i you know wish you guys the best because you've always taken care of us at yeah, downtown crown love coming um, down downtown crown. Guys, looking forward to friday yeah coming friday out hanging out. january 22nd guys come support another local brewery out of baltimore five to eight dollar dollar beer for snow pants we wear snow pants um overall a good blast. time yeah hopefully we get snowed in yeah cheers guys <laughs> cheers cheers yep. Dave, 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 Dave.